is the moment. Tonight is the night. Hey guys, it's Cryptomio Analysis coming at you with a new video on Jasmine. So, um, I need to stop saying um, but I had one of my viewers request this coin, and so I will make a video on it. I remember when Jasmine was first listed on Coinbase. I remember when Jasmine was at 24, 25 cents. And then it dropped down all the way to, I it was like 100x. But the thing is that the circulation supply is fully distributed now. Uh, so there are like no more surprises. So if you do, if you come over here on coin market cap and you hit market cap, you'll see that uh, all of the circulation supply has been distributed. Uh, and it's going up. So these are all good signs. But can it hit a dollar? Can it hit these levels? I don't even count that because I don't. Because it got listed on Coinbase at like 25 cents. So um, I don't know where it was a dollar, two dollars, but I'm not going to base it off of that, right? Maybe I can just actually look at Coinbase. Yeah, so it got listed 35 cents, sorry. So I'll do some quick TA on it. Yeah, so we're overbought. Stock RSI is resetting, so, so that's interesting. And just keep in mind when we're when we're in a bull run, it really likes to stay up here. So it could just uh, sorry, it could just so go back down like it did here, and then like bounce and make a higher high, but like get lower. This might go all the way back down, and then the next target might but might get hit, and then you could kind of compare the two, and then see see that it's going in the right it's going in the right direction, um, and it's bullish. So that's what I always like to do. Uh, and it's the opposite when we're in a bear, um, uh, when we're in a bear market. So when we're in a bear market, the reverse is possible because look, like we were oversold here, and then we were oversold here, and you can see that the price action was actually lower. So the price went from 0 0.004 over uh, sold to 0 0.003. So the same. So so you can kind of gauge it like it, it like I did this with OXT and Doggle on Mars. You know, you always want to buy it here in the now when it's oversold uh, and dollar cost average down. You never want to catch it in the green because by the time it's in the green, it's already in the bull run and you don't even have to worry about buying anymore because you already have your position. Anyway, um, just food for thought, do whatever you want with it. But uh, let's do some TA. So you want to take your uh, fit from the high to the low. And basically, it needs to be over the three. Uh, sorry, the two, three, six. But I think that, I mean, Jasmine fell by a lot, so it has. I think it has a long ways to go um, to be uh, macro bullish, right? What was it? Two six. I think it was two six. Okay. So, as you can see, uh, I guess we're not really that far off. What is that? A three x? It's very possible. Yeah, so 3x to, um, so Jasmine needs to be above eight and a half cents to be macro bullish. Just look at your phone. If it's under eight and a half cents, it's still not considered macro bullish. We'll just leave it there. Now, short term, let's look into where it needs to hold. So you want to take your fib, you want to take it from this low to this high and it needs to stay above the 382 which it has so it's still considered it's still considered bullish is it above the 236 um yes it is and then the next target is going to be it's always going to be uh three and a half cents so i mean these are just like small targets right because then once that hits goes back down maybe comes back down here goes back you know you, you take your fit from here to there and then the next target up is going to be you know four and a half cents so it's it's slowly you know getting up there i think that when bitcoin breaks this all-time high this thing's going to go flying as far as targets go like <clears throat> you always have to do your research so like what is jasmine supposed to do and what the market cap is and then what's the, like who's the leading um crypto in the space so like, for example, like Cardano, how high can Cardano go? Well, Cardano is doing what Ethereum is doing. So theoretically, like that market cap 
conservatively divided by two, right? Um, you, you always have to have targets. Uh, or like Dogecoin, or sorry, uh, Dog on Mars for me, right? So Dog on Mars is like, okay, how high can it go? How high did, how high did Do Dogecoin go? How high did Do uh, Dog on Mars go? So you really have to like do your research and figure it out and, and see how high uh, it can go. But from a fit perspective, if we do break the um, all time high, sorry, if we do break the 236 and we are truly in a huge macro bull run, No, 26. Okay, I'll just do 33. That's fine. We're looking at anywhere between, uh, and this is like God candles, right? Like, and which is possible, right? Um, it's possible. We saw what we, we saw what a lot of coins last last um, bull run. So we're looking at between 56 cents. These are just like this is just my opinion. Uh, between 50, 50 uh, 56 cents and 91 cents. That's like best case scenario, right? I think that, can it come back to this all-time high? I don't know. I'm not in JSV. I don't know if I'd ever buy it because um, I just, it's at $1 billion, or $1 billion market cap. It can happen. So 50X would put it at a dollar, would put it at 50 billion. So that's not really that far off. You can 50X uh, or like for anybody that bought it in. Congratulations to whoever, whoever, for everyone who, who held through the bear market and bought dollar cost average jump because you're already up 10x. You don't even have to worry about putting in more money. But um, how high can it go? I think that it can go between, I think conservatively speaking, between 25 cents and 50 cents. But if you want to be a moon boy, if you think that it's, it's going to the moon or Mars or whatever, I think that a realistic target is uh, anything under a dollar. I think... Uh, I think one to do two dollars is also possible. Shiba Inu hit a hundred billion. Why can't this coin that's um, uh, that actually does have utility go to two bucks, right? But that's I don't know. I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not clickbait, right? Like for me, I would have gotten in here and I would probably get out after like twenty five cents because from here, like especially seeing this, and if you held it this long, twenty five cents is very possible like at towards the end of the bull run we have the god candles you sell you make your money you're out can it go higher of course it can i don't know that's just that would just be my game plan like 25 cents 50 cents um very 25 cents to 50 cents very possible these are this that's just my opinion i showed you my uh like the targets the short-term target long-term target so yeah if you like my video on jasmine please like subscribe comment let me know if you want me to add this to my rotation and uh and again congratulations to everybody bought on the way down i did the same thing with oxt i did the same thing with dog on mars and now i don't even have to look at it like i'm like all right i'm already up like so much like just let it ride you know um if you're here for life-changing money you gotta you, you can't just sell yourself short or try to hold do the whole thing of buying now and or sorry selling now and buying back that doesn't work i've tried I did that in 2018 and it, it, it shot me in the foot, um, especially when we're in a bull run. If we're in a bear market, yeah, sure, because like you could also kind of gauge it off the RSI indicator, which is what I really like to do and I found it very, uh, it's very doable with that. I think it's, it's very possible with using the RSI indicator um, and your favorite retracement to see where it's ex exactly going to land. But we're, ladies and gentlemen, we are in a bull run. 2024, 2025 early is a bull run. So we're, we're going up. I mean, that's for sure. Please like, subscribe, comment. Thank you so much for your support. And uh, I will maybe make another video on Jasmine, depending on if uh, the community wants videos on Jasmine. Thank you.